hobbies because I'm a mom. I have no hobbies because I'm a mom. I have no hobby because I'm a mommy. I have no hobbies because I'm a mommy. I'm a mommy with no hobbies. I'm a mommy with no hobbies. I'm a mommy. That's why I don't have hobbies. Daddy thinks cleaning is my hobby. Daddy thinks cleaning is my hobby. Daddy thinks that cleaning is my hobby. It's my hobby because I'm a mommy. It's my hobby. <laughs> I have no hobbies because I'm a mom. I have no hobbies because I'm a mom. Mm. I'm a mom with no hobbies. Ah. Mm, mm. It's because I'm a mom. I don't have hobbies. Mommy, stop it. <laughs> I have no hobbies because I'm a mommy. I have no hobbies because I'm a mommy. I'm a mommy with no hobbies. I got no hobbies. <laughs> It's because I'm a mommy that I have no hobbies. My husband thinks cleaning is my hobby. My husband thinks cleaning is my hobby. It's my hobby because I'm a mommy. <laughs> it's my hobby because I'm a mommy. Hey guys, I'm Lisa, aka Mommy Sim, 
for my Roblox obsessed four year old. Um, I don't know about you guys, but before I was a mom, I had hobbies. I used to go out dancing with my friends at clubs. I loved rollerblading, I loved cooking, I loved going to the beach. And then when I gave birth, all that just stopped. I mean, I mean it made sense because I'm a full-time mom, I'm a full-time nurse, so there was no time for hobbies. You know, my husband, he had all the hobbies. He has all the hobbies to this day. <laughs> Um, but he did say one wise thing to me. He said, Lisa, you need to get some hobbies. And I listened to him. And I'm glad I did because I discovered my love of DIYs and plants and just, you know, just making things with my hands. It's really fun. I feel like I'm in kindergarten again, cutting and pasting and making art projects, which I, I absolutely love. So, I'm really excited to share my love of DIYs and, and plants with all of you guys. Um, I'm really excited to show you my Easter DIYs. So, subscribe, stay tuned so you don't miss the video, and join our familia. I guess you're still listening. Well, since I have you here, I might as well um, show you my past DIYs. So I'm pretty obsessed with beach, Hawaii, anything tropical. So in our other home, I really couldn't decorate, um, you know, the couches and the furniture. So I pretty much made it feel like a tropical paradise on the walls and the ceiling. So these are just a little bit of the DIYs that I did. So I made a Hawaiian wreath and a Hawaiian garland. Here you see like a splash of plumeria flower. Um, and that's a pearl, yep. <laughs> I glued each and every pearl and Hawaiian flower and seashell to make this piece of work. It is so cute. I love it. I hung it on our hallway and it just brought a smile to my face every day. Here is another garland and this one's a little bit more plain looking. <laughs> I think this one was my first and then that one was my second uh, DIY garland. I splashed it up with pearls and put some pearls <laughs> inside the plumeria. <laughs> I mean, I glued every single pearl and seashell. Took hours. I loved every single minute of it. This is a wreath that I made for our front door along with the aloha sign. Um, I also made like little end pieces that I attached to, um, you know, nice nautical rope garland and I just hung those around the hallways and it made, really made it feel like Hawaii. I loved it. I love the beach. I made a seashell garland and just put some nautical rope and <laughs> nice nautical garland so that was fun and in the back you'll see a bunch of just green foliage type of garland that I used to layer on top of each other so it made it look very tropical here is the foliage I was telling you about I put this by our mini tiki bar area that we had inside um, and decorated it with all this <laughs> and pieces and beach and the signs that I got and just layered garland on top of garland. Those were my first DIYs and I'm sorry but I didn't have the foresight to record um, videos of it hanging on my walls or take pictures of it or if I did it's deleted from my phone. Um, those pictures were taken um, before I boxed everything up because we were moving to our new house. 
so I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did in making those lovely DIYs.